Hey guys, welcome to episode 2 of Pokemon Go. I just parked at El Carrizo Park and so far it looks pretty good. Uh, it's a pretty big park. There's a lot of, um, there's a couple of Pokestops around and there seems to be like three gyms. And then there's a Mankey within my range too that I'm about to catch in a bit. But first, um, an update as to what I've done since the last episode. Um, I did catch uh, an Eevee, a Meowth, a Venonat, CP70, which is my highest one right now, and a Pidgey since my last episode. I caught those, and that almost has me to level 4. And also as to the egg, I did take a couple of steps. So I'm 1.4 into my 2 kilometer egg. So hopefully it will hatch today. And yeah, that's pretty much it that I've done so far. So let's just go ahead and catch this Mankey first. Look, I'm just chilling in my dashboard. Pretty good. All right, so we just added this Mankey to the Pokedex. So CP 11, three Mankey candies. So I'm 80 XP away from level four. So even if I catch a Pokemon I already have, that'll give me the 100 XP. So I'll be able to level up. But yeah, so we're gonna go ahead for a walk now and I'm gonna hit up these Pokestops and see which Pokemons I encounter. So I found some shade to sit down on. Uh, sorry about the audio too, it's kind of windy. Um, so I found some shade underneath this tree. And right now I'm stand, well I'm sitting in between two of the Pokestops. But what's most exciting is that there are two Clefairies within my range. So I'm gonna go ahead and try and catch this one. That's right next to me. So it's a good throw. One, two, three. Oh, so what? Wow, that Clefairy just fucking just disappeared. Let's try and catch this other one then. Oh, this one's weaker. It's a CP45. The other one just had question marks. Let's see. Come on, don't do this. Okay, there you go. All right, so we got one Clefairy out of the two. And with that, level up to level 4 now. Let's see, so that's 3 Clefairy Candies. There you go, level 4. And let's collect these Pokestops. So the first one is El Carrizo Hot Shots Memorial. Six firefighters lost their lives during 1966. So four Pokeballs. And let's collect the other one. The second one, El Carrizo Park Gymnasium. So that gives me three Pokeballs. So it looks like, oh, there you go, level four. And give me 15 Pokeballs. So right now, there's a lot of Pokemon around. Uh, one of them is the Vulpix that I really want, and the Cubone. So let's go ahead and try and get those. So I didn't even have to walk that far and a Growlithe appeared. Right after I got done recording, I just, a Growlithe appeared and I caught him with the first Pokeball. And look at how beast this guy is. CP of 127 and Ember that does 10 damage and then Flamethrower does 50 damage. I've been getting really lucky in this spot, this park has a lot of Pokemon nearby. A Geodude just appeared, which it's a brand new Pokemon for me. CP of 56, let's go ahead and try and catch this guy. And throw him a curveball. Almost a great throw, it was a little low. Uh, and there you go, first throw, first ball ever, and I caught the Geodude. So it goes with, oh, I didn't get the curveball bonus. But there goes 600 XP. Geodude is registering to the Pokedex. 
So he needs 25 candies and then rock to him of 25. Not bad. Level 56. Well, CP of 56. But look at this. It's a Sandshrew and a Cubone nearby. So I'm going to go ahead and try and catch these guys. And once again, this is a great spot. I'm so excited I decided to come over here. Check it out. A Puneta just appeared. It's CP19, so it's pretty weak, but it's still a new Pokemon, so I'm really excited for it. Let's see if we can catch it with the first Pokeball. No! The app just froze. Okay guys, I got lucky. The app froze, but when I restarted it, there you go. Ponita is on my Pokedex. Ponita. What it? Did I say Ponita last time? Ponita is registered on my Pokedex. So CP19 Ponita. Brand new Pokemon. Guys, this is it. The moment we've all been waiting for. This two kilometer egg is finally about to hatch. My very first egg. Let's see what I get. Oh, I'm so excited. Hopefully it's one of the starter Pokemons. So bad. Oh, well, 13 Subat candies, CP45, not bad, okay, I guess I'll take it, crap, I was so excited for nothing. Oh, check it out, guys, as soon as I got disappointed with that egg hatch of a Subat, I started walking back and I caught another Subat, I just got it for the candy. But now an Oddish appeared in my car as I was about to drive off home. So let's see, let's hope we get this Oddish. So excited, it's a brand new Pokemon. I'm always excited for new Pokemon, no matter what they are. It's a CP of 102, so pretty strong Oddish. Looks like I need 25 candies to evolve in, I have three. And ooh, so close to getting that level four. But I could not find any of the other Pokemons. I kept walking around, I could not find that Cubone or that Sandshrew, which is what I really wanted. But I did, however, manage to get another egg, another two kilometer egg from one of the Pokestops. Um, on my way back, I decided to pick up the same Pokestop again. And I got a two kilometer egg. So many brand new Pokemons. We got the, who did we get today? We got Clefairy, Oddish, we got Ponita, Geodude, Growlithe, and the Mankey. All brand new Pokemon, such an awesome adventure. Um, unfortunately, we got that crappy Subat off the two kilometer, two kilometer egg. However, we did get that second two kilometer egg and when I was on my way back, I decided to stop at another Pokestop. And I got a 5 kilometer egg. So as soon as I'm done incubating that second kilometer egg, I'm going to pop that 5 kilometer egg in there and see what Pokemon we get off of it. Um, and I d oh, and also I decided to hold off on reaching level 5. Time was cutting a little short for me. But I will make sure to report that for tomorrow on the episode number three of my Pokemon Go adventure. So I hope you guys like this episode. I go. I hope you guys like my series. And let me know how I'm doing. Give me some advice, some pointers, or just some comments. You know, anything would be appreciated. Subscribe to my channel and please like this video. So thank you for stopping by and you guys have a great day.